Uh, living in this world where we're all working virtually, how has that impacted um, how you guys operate the association? Yeah, I think, you know, a lot of like a lot of companies that were doing, you know, whether it was face to face meetings or face to face conferences, it was education is still important and making sure that um, you have access to resources and you just have to you just have to shift and you have to adjust to, to the current environment. Um, and we made we have an annual conference that we do every year and this year we were able to bring it back to um, in person, which we were oh, very great. Excited about. So, um, you know, it's just about being um, adjusting and pivoting, but, you know, you talked a little bit about technology and I think technology has opened the floodgates of data and right. the need to not only analyze, but understand, interpret and apply it. So this is, you know, what this means for organizations is specialized skills, as I mentioned earlier, and this is where AFP kind of comes in. Um, you know, a, a consequence of the age of data is that more resources are shifting to data analysis. Automation will eventually handle more traditional, you know, accounting functions. So this is mm -hmm. why FNA, um, you know, financial planning and analysis is really driving uh, the future of corporate finance. And why we developed um, our FP&A C certification um, in 2014. So uh, both our certifications, the CTP, which is a certified treasury professional, and the FP&A C, which is the um, certified corporate financial planning and analysis professional, are ways that individuals can upscale and provide more value to the organizations.